Hey, my name is Jonas and I like to make stuff. So uh, I'm just kind of giving you an intro uh, into who I am and what it is that I do. Um, so my company name is Modus Works. It started uh, in 2016. I started making lanyard beads and uh, then we, uh, I say we, it's just me. Um, then I, I um, started making different things here and there and then somebody asked me to make, make some spinner grips and that led to increased popularity and uh, now I primarily make spinners uh, and grips. Um, so anyways, a little journey through the EDC community there and, and worked my way up and, uh, and now um, I'm just making this video to increase my brand awareness and kind of show people what I do. A lot of people seem interested in uh, how, I, how I make stuff and um, what all goes into making the products that I make. So I uh, figured I would I would uh, make the video just to, to show you around and, and um, this will be the first of a series called Modus Works Monday. And I'll try to have a video up every week um, on Monday and I'm not going to set some unrealistic goal for myself um, so I'm just going to try to hit most Mondays, we'll put it that way. So alright, I'll take you off the tripod and show you around the workshop. All right, so here's my work area, the workshop. I'll just go down the line here and show you the machines. Uh, that's a belt grinder, built that myself. There's my drill press. Got a horizontal bandsaw for chopping up raw material. Got a welder for making stuff like the, the belt grinder and the uh, forge and, and the press that are down there. Got a tooling cabinet uh, that holds all the tools for my CNC mill, which is a brand new acquisition that I'm just now learning how to how to use, but I love this thing. Um, but it's a whole different world trying to figure out how to make stuff with a CNC machine. But it was something that had to happen, something I had to do uh, to stay uh, profitable um, and to keep up with the times. Um, I did well. Uh, to begin with, with the manual machines, but the popularity is such that uh, it has forced my hand and I have had to increase my production. So, uh, it's a Haas TM1P and it seems to be an awesome machine so far. This is my fab table, it's a catch-all. Uh, just so you know, if you don't have a workshop, you'll find out uh, if you do one, if you do have one one day, that any horizontal work, work surface, such as this, and such as this vertical bandsaw table and such as this tooling cabinet and even the little tiny drill press table focus 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 drill press table all horizontal work surfaces are a catch-all so yeah anyways heat treat oven um, I had annealed some bronze with that uh, last week uh, this is my twisting rig for twisting Damascus. We got a pr big propane tank and a forge here for making Damascus. Uh, I make t uh, titanium Damascus, steel Damascus, uh, and Mokume Gane, um, which is brass and copper um, Damascus, for lack of a better term. It's a, it's a layered material. Um, this is my hydraulic forge for putting all that stuff together. Uh, hydraulic forge. It's a hydraulic press for putting all, that metals, all those metals together. Uh, here's my Excello mill. This is made. This is made probably at least four or five hundred spinners by itself. I made probably a hundred spinners on this machine. Um, there's a little pile of uh, unfinished spinners right here. And then uh, cabinets, tool cabinets, more tool cabinets lathe, big lathe for turning down raw stock, um, small tooling cabinet for this lathe, this lathe is my main production lathe uh, for those spinner buttons. We got two anvils, this is a 300 pounder and I love it, uh, it's so solid. 300 pound uh, arm and hammer, um, probably made in the 1920s or 30s and then we've got a, well maybe my drill bit, bits here. We've got a 90 pound Fisher Eagle, um, Fisher and Norris Eagle. So that's that was my first anvil, I paid 700 for that one. That was my second anvil, I paid 1000 for that one. So 300 versus 90, 
a uh, thousand versus seven hundred I can you can imagine which one I think I got a better deal on uh, so yeah that's uh, that's my workshop so um, just wanted to show you around and, and again give you an intro to um, to my workshop and intro to me and uh, here let's look at what I'm working on right now these are all prototype um, these are not these are not finals but these are there's one that one's decent um, that's a prototype spinner that I've been working on it's called the machinima thing so if you uh, want to learn about the machinima thing or the spinima thing then uh, check out my Facebook group I'll leave the link in the description have a good day guys thank you